Welcome back to the Bobcat Sports Showcase. I'm Carter Rodriguez, and myself, Kaylee Donigan, and Pat Chiesa are here to preview the basketball season ahead. Of course, we all know that the Ohio Bobcats made a sweet 16 run last year, and almost every notable name is back from that team except one, head coach John Gross, who went to Illinois in the offseason, and to replace him is Jim Christian. However, the team doesn't see a big change in philosophy. They're still going to press hard on defense and force turnovers. You know, he's really been preaching rebounding um, a lot lately. Uh, but that's nothing that, that Coach Gross didn't uh, preach when he was here. He preached rebounding, you know, communicating on defense, talking on defense, doing things like that. And also rebounding the ball and offensively having freedom, hitting open shots, hitting open guys, passing the ball. So I think it's a little bit uh, similar in different ways. Just how they approach things may be a little bit different, but in the same, in the same. We do have some familiar faces this year, but some new opponents. We're going to kick it over to Kaylee Donegan next with a look at the schedule. Thanks, Carter. The moment is finally here. Ohio kicks off its regular season play against Portland right here in the Convo at 2 p.m. The game will be part of a six-game homestand to start things off for the Cats. But this non-conference portion of the schedule won't be a walk in the park for the Bobcats. With big road trips to Memphis and Oklahoma and having Oakland at home, the Cats will face some challenges. But they have the perfect mentality for non-conference play. Um, you know, like I said, every game counts. Uh, every game matters. Uh, and the most important game is, is the next one on the schedule. So, you know, when it comes to those big time games like that, uh, you know, we, we, we see that as a, as a great opportunity and, and as a challenge. Uh, to, you know, it's just show what, that we belong with some of those big name teams. We, the one thing that's been great here is we've, we, I've inherited a team that has a great mentality. I think they understand, you know, the importance of every game. They understand how hard you have to play. Tough schedule up for the Bobcats, but this team has plenty of high expectations. Pat, we'll toss it to you. Hype. Such a simple word can make or break a college basketball team. Take a team that made the Sweet 16 a season ago and is bringing back all five starters and the expectations for these young men can seemingly be unfair. But this Ohio team has made it crystal clear that they're taking this, game, this season one game and one basket at a time. I try to tune some of that stuff out. You know, obviously uh, it comes with the territory. Uh, we had a really good season last year. Um, and I, like it's like we've mentioned, uh, returning everybody. Obviously, there's going to be talk and uh, and this and that. But you know, our main focus is just try coming out here every day, trying to get better, uh, and hopefully trying to get back to the point that we were at last year. Just channeling it all out, really. Um, obviously, we have a lot of expectations, but you know, you defeat that by taking game by game, practice by practice. You know, not looking at the you know broad sort of sort of things, the broad, broad picture as far as how far guys guys are saying we might be Final Four bound or. No sweet 16 bound or something like that. I'm just looking at it for a game by game basis and a practice by practice trying to get better and we can go from there. 